In Summit County, jury selection is underway for the Dennis Ross retrial. Ross is accused of murdering 18 year old Hannah Hill in 1999. In 2000, Ross went on trial for Hill's murder, but a judge declared a mistrial after learning jurors discussed a lie detector test that was not presented during the trial. News Channel 5's Bob Jones joins us live now. And Bob, the judge is saying that this retrial could last up to eight weeks. Well, that's right, Lee, and that would be a full month longer than the first time that Denny Ross went on trial for the murder of Hannah Hill. And part of the reason could be science and explaining that all to the jury. Prosecutors say they have new DNA evidence from the victim's fingerprints and the car liner of her car that links Ross to the crime. She was found strangled and stuffed inside her geo prism in an Akron Ellett neighborhood back in 1999. Also, in this case, there are hundreds of possible witnesses. Some of the jurors may be aware the first trial ended in a mistrial. Of course, Lee, this was a very high profile case. So, Bob, what are the jurors being asked, and how many more jurors are expected to be questioned? Well, there is a jury pool of about 135 jurors, and we got a hold of the jury questionnaire form late this afternoon. There are 27 questions on it. Some of the major questions are, what have you heard or what do you know about the Hannah Hill murder? Also, there is a question about pretrial publicity. That is a question that will be brought up again Wednesday and Thursday when the jury pool is brought back to the court, and then they hope to have the jury seated by Friday.